and welcome to my channel. So today I'm doing a flip through of this book. It's Dainty Damsels, uh, the spring collection, and the illustrator is JN Sheets. Now she has a few books out with, they're all different collections. So I've got another one. Uh, I've got a Halloween collection. If you like this book, after I flipped it, you can look up in the corner, which will still be there at the end of the video with a link to the Halloween uh, flip through. And this is the back cover. So this is a Create Space book. It's slightly smaller than A4. Let me just, I've got an A4 book here. I've literally just filmed the flip for this one, so that's handy. So this is how it shapes up. A little bit on the, little bit less on the width, quite a bit less on the depth. So yeah, they her books are slightly smaller than A4, and they're also not the fattest ones either. Um, there's a limited amount of images in them, but the flip side to that is these books are uh, very budget friendly. So um, yeah, it's all good. It doesn't matter, there's not a lot in there. They're all good. Anyway, so glossy cover. Let's get straight into this flip through. And get it opened up. So this is the, just the intro page. Uh, she does have a WordPress site as well, blog. Her work. I think I've read that she does uh, books, writes books as well. She's not just an illustrator, she writes books. Okay, so here we go. Colour oh yes, so there's a bit, a little bit saying of her other books. She's got more than that now though, I'm sure. Yeah, because I'm sure she's got two Halloween ones. And yeah, Paranormal Fantasy. I'd like to check her out sometime. But anyway. We have ourselves a blotter page here. So this is a page where you can test your mediums on and it says, do you see spots? So if it's bled through, whatever you've used has bled through to this page, then you know not to use it on your images or at least put some blotter paper in between. Uh, in fact, she says that. Make sure you put some paper between if you get spots. And we're into the first image. So you'll see, is the, well, you probably guessed that from the front cover. She does these sort of big headed, big eyed, uh, sort of anime style ish cutesy girls and uh, as this is a spring collection I think flowers are a bit of a theme so, nice thing about this book as you can see it's one sided which means you can use alcohol markers I love this one she's getting that, like her, her off the shoulder sweater uh, and great if you enjoy colouring hair which fortunately I do hair and flowers this is like my happy place so we have ourselves another girl here. She seems one of these sort of corset things, which is quite nice with butterflies on that fits in with the theme. She's got some butterflies around her. This is, is it a fun cover? No, but it is that same sort of um, frame, the flowery frame. This is a cute one. She's got her bunny ears on. So she's like the, this is like the Easter bunny. She's even got a sort of little bunny nose. That's that's cute. Oh, that's a giant carrot. I've just realised. She's holding a giant carrot. That's brilliant. <laughs> oh, well. okay. So again, we have this uh, round frame with the flowers. I really like this one. This little girl. She's got the butterfly on her finger, but we've got ourselves a little bee, and the flowers are even on her dress. I think that might be the one I do first. Again, we've got these curly curly hair. Another sort of bigger portrait face. Ah, right, so this is the front cover with a uh, circular one. It's so just a little bit of a shame that, um, look, you can see, I mean, they've cropped it a little bit there, but this one is a lot more. Uh, I think it would have been nicer if they'd have shrunk it down so we could get all the flowers on as opposed to it bleeding off the page. I guess they've done it to feel, you know, so that they're not, um, wasting too much space at the bottom because this one again feels like it might have been cropped off I think she might I'll have a look I'll try and remember and have a look and see if she I got this book on Amazon but I'll have a look and see if she sells like the PDFs on Etsy as well because it might be that the PDFs have the whole image I love these I love her boots she's like a fairy though another big eyed big faced girl So she is almost like a dog. I mean, she's got buttons down the front here and uh, oh, the big ringlets there. But um, 
Yeah. Another one of these ones, that are a bit like that one I liked before with the sweater that's off the shoulder. She, like some of these seem quite um, formal and posed, and these ones just seem sort of relaxed. And do you know what I mean? They're um, it's almost like if it was a photograph, this would be the one. This would be the candid shot where it was taken without them really realising it. I like that style. I wish there was more like this one. And I don't know, a little fox, I think. Another one again, a portrait. We've got this funny little rabbit thing. Actually, they're her ears as well, aren't they? Her floppy ears. Doesn't, maybe she doesn't like the bee. But yeah, you definitely want to enjoy climbing flowers if you uh, if you like this style of book. I love this swirly dress of hers. Swirly dress, swirly hair. And the frame for the picture, that's like one of those um, garden, you know, trellis things, isn't it? I wonder if they're all meant to be, she might be a fa another fairy. I mean, she's not got wings. There's a sweater girl again. And that is it. So I, I counted up the other day. I can't remember. I think it was something like 15 or 16. Something around that mark of images. So it, it's a decent amount of images for the price of book. I think I only paid £2.70 for this, which is about $3. But I think its normal price is about £4. So going on $5. Uh, but still, yeah, an extremely budget-friendly book for these really cutesy anime style girls if you love that anime style you will love this i guarantee anyway i hope this flip through was useful if you enjoyed it give me a thumbs up and uh yeah if you've not subscribed to the channel then if you hit the little button below and the bell then you get a notification of any time i upload new videos thank you so much for watching i hope you have a great day take care and see you again soon bye for now bye